and welcome back to 402. Uh, last time, Stephen Merchant called me bossy, and we and I'm not happy about that. That's why we must confront him and prove how not bossy I am. see we're in a scrapyard of some kind and we must find a way to get out of this scrapyard and back into Aperture Science also while trying to get the hell out of there you can win but there are more treasures to find it like you the hell out of here I'm sorry can you imagine if I was like that Here is our incredible giant door once again. Oh, and now here's a time challenge here. Basically we've got to press both the buttons in, in, in like four seconds I think. which is easy to do and now the giant door is opening Volunteered to be injected with praying mantis DNA, 
I've got some good news and some bad news. Bad news is we're postponing those tests indefinitely. Good news is we've got a much better test for you. Fighting an army of Mantis men. Pick up a rifle and follow the yellow line. You'll know when the test starts. Oh, really? Repulsion gels or Mantis men? Oh, I wonder which one we want. Well, I was going to say Mantis men, but I don't have a shotgun. I don't think the ball gun's going to work unless if I put a poor gun next to them and they'll fall into a pit and die. But I won't get my shotgun until episode 3 comes out. Uh, but I haven't paid attention to Star Wars movies. Oh, you're an idiot! <laughs> Let's just pray that we can take on some of the Madness men in this. They say great science is built on the shoulders of giants. Not here. At Amateur, we do all our science from scratch. No hand-holding. I, I think that's also how you start a flea circus. You start from scratch. Yeah, that's why I went there. All right, let's get started. This first test involves something the lab boys call repulsion gel. You're not part of the control group, by the way. You get the gel. Last poor son of a gun got blue paint. <laughs> All joking aside, that did happen. Broke every bone in his legs. Tragic, but informative. Or so I'm told. And if you recognise, and these are the blue gels that you should probably recognise from from the co-op mode. The lab boys just informed me that I should not have mentioned the control group. They're telling me I ought to stop making these pre-recorded messages. That gave me an idea. Make more pre-recorded messages. I pay the bills here. I can talk about the control group all damn day. For this next test, we put nanoparticles in the gel. In layman's terms, that's a billion little gizmos that are going to travel into your bloodstream and pump experimental genes and RNA molecules and so forth into your tumors. Now, maybe you don't have any tumors. Well, don't no worry. If you sat on a bully chair in the lobby and weren't wearing lead underpants, we took care of that too. Here's some advice the lab boys gave me. Do not get covered in the repulsion gel. We haven't entirely nailed down what element it is yet, but I'll tell you this, it's a lively one, and it does not like the human skeleton. Okay, on that note, by Mr. Dave Johnson, join us next time for more Portal Madness in Portal 2.